hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel my name is amin ola today's video i'll be showing you guys how i make this tip part frontal wig how i coil it so definitely if you're new here you're welcome and if this is not your first time watching my video you're all welcome so let's get started don't let's waste our time <laughs> So guys this is how i ventilate the frontal and if you guys haven't watched the video maybe you miss it when i upload it you are not online you can check your top right corner over there click the video and watch it so that you will catch up with us So guys this is the result of uh, the frontal so definitely if you guys watch the video and you try as much as possible to watch everything without skipping you have to get something that is very beautiful like this or something that is more better than this so right now i've secured uh, the frontal done and the next thing to do is to sew it down with a uh, needle and thread so i will go off camera to do that and after the frontal i've already sewed and so right now i'm crocheting the ear on the black cap So after I finish crochet the black cap, this is how the ear is looking like. I've detangled the ear very well, I comb it very well and I cream it. So right now I will be straightening it with my iron and I'm doing this on a low heat so that the ear will not melt and will make sure anytime you want to do this, do it on a low heat. Right now I finished pressing the ear and I hope you can see how the here is shining, it gives us popping looking. So right now I'll be patting it small by small and be braiding it. So guys after braiding the hair the next step now is to go for our water treatment hot water treatment rather and this is washing a shampoo that is dove i will pour a little amount inside the bowl and i will also put a little amount of oil so that it will leave all the hair shine i'm using baby johnson oil I also pour a little amount of it so that is it and after that i will pour the hot water on it and i will put the hair inside it Leave it for some minutes inside the 
hot water and then i will bring it out so definitely this is the day after i remove it from the hot water and i'm just pampering it with a uh, towel so i will unravel it quickly before the air dry so that the air will not be freezing if the air is dry before you lose the coil it may not look very good like that but make sure the air is not dry enough before you lose the braid so guys after unraveling every braid this is how the ear is looking like so guys if you enjoy watching this video don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up comment down below let me know what you think about this uh, try to put, uh, turn on your notification bell so that anytime i post a new video you'll be notified comment share subscribe like my video and don't forget to meet me in my next video bye guys